In other news tonight, we hope to never need them, but we're glad to know they're here. We're talking about search and rescue teams and the critical role they play in our communities. Now an Eastern Kentucky University professor is looking to grow the next generation of rescuers through a new club. Josh Short has the story. They can happen anywhere and anytime. An EKU assistant professor has had the chance to live out these search and rescue missions, which is why he's so passionate about training the next generation with a student-based search and rescue group. And the purpose of that is to provide some experiential learning opportunities to students so that they can start to get involved in uh, actual outdoor and wilderness responses. It's already gotten some interest from students, but it's not just them. Faculty, staff, and Madison County community members have all been invited to join the group. So we're going to specialize in, in two things, general search and rescue, so searching for lost and missing people, and that also includes helping out other existing search and rescue teams on some of these big searches where they just need a lot of manpower and a lot of support to cover a lot of ground. And then the second thing is unmanned aerial system support, so drones. Being able to fly drones with uh, thermal imaging cameras, drones that can serve as airborne repeaters for radio communications and, and that kind of stuff. It's meant to be a huge opportunity for anyone wanting to get in this line of work with a chance to assist the teams that do this full time. So we don't just sit in a lecture hall looking at PowerPoints all day long. We do the things that our students uh, need to be prepared to do on their own as professionals. It isn't the first time EKU has taken class outside in the skies and even in situations where people need help. Just like we have uh, student pilots who are flying uh, actual airplanes and operating an actual airport, and we have our paramedic students who are out there doing clinical rotations, riding along with ambulance crews, uh, so on and so forth. Uh, the members of the EKU search and rescue team are, are going to be learning how to do the skills that they're uh, basically studying. In Richmond, Josh Short, Fox 56 News.